How's it going everyone? Welcome to the Bunch of Dudes section where I open packs. This time we're doing another pack battle. Me versus Schaefer. Um, so for this one, I picked up Ignition's Assault, which is where um, the Plunder Patrol archetype, I think, was first introduced, or at least there are Plunder Patrol in this set, I know that for sure. Um, yeah, for this pack battle, it's a little bit different, but um, I thought it'd be cool. I've been watching One Piece, and I've been really enjoying it, and I really enjoy um, Yu-Gi-Oh, so I wanted to do some kind of collab with them, and so I was thinking, um, what's the closest thing that I can discern between Yu-Gi-Oh and One Piece, and that's Pirates. So, that's why I got Ignition as Assault for the Plunder Patrol, and, um, I sent off a box to, like I said, Schaefer, the other Bunch of Dudes member, and he'll be opening some packs that I uh, have uh, cured and gathered. And so I'll wait for, for that part of the video for you to see what he got exactly. But we're going to open up this Ignition's Assault. See if we can open some cool packs. Maybe get something, uh, get a Starlight. That'd be really cool. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. For this pack battle, it'll be value to value. So... Whatever I pull against whatever Schaefer pulls, we will, um, yeah, add up the totals and whoever has the most at the end is going to win, is how we're going to do it for this one. But yeah, Ignition Assault, you can't talk, but uh, yeah, first pack, Ignition Assault, first dead, English. What we can get. I'm hoping for some Plunder Patrol. I like the artwork for that. Um, Starlight Rare would be really cool. But, um, I think I've ne oh, yeah, I've never opened this set before, so anything will be a lot of fun. Um, should we do a pack trick? Yeah, let's do two, three to the back. Three from the back. Megalith Portal. Megalith. Bethel, Bethor, um, the Winds of Mischief, Megalith, Haggath, Shiny Black Sea Squad, or squ Squatter, yeah. um, Ghost Meets Girl, um, Resurgent XYZ and a super rare. That's pretty cool. So, four from the back. Let's do four from the back. But nice. It's a Super Shogun MDL. It's pretty nice. Looking hollow. I really like that. Just for a super, that looks really nice. I'm happy about that. Good card. Put all our hollows over there. Cool. The next one. I'm not really gonna concern about one side or the other. I'm just gonna throw my hand over and pick a pack. Pick a pick a pack. One, two, three, and four. I feel like this is gonna be wrong. Fire Phoenix at Ignister. Maybe not. Um, Megalith Oach. Karkori Cashin. TAI Strike. Um, Karkori Gamma. The Time Thief, Calcafita, Link Party, and a Time Thief, Perpetua. That is also a super rare. I guess supers are are guaranteed in this this set. Pack number three.
one, two, three, four. To the back. See, sometimes on these like holographic names, it's hard to read. Something ancient warrior saga. That's what it looks like. Um, puppet. Megalith portal. Time thief startup. And add Ignister card. Armory call. Uh, gravity controller. Link party. Witchcraft Jenny. <laughs> I like how her, uh, her glasses are hollowed. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice card. Level 1 card. This is, yeah, pack four. Some interesting pulls. Here we go. Um, Megalith, Fall Leg, Fall Leg, Fall Leg, Resurgence, Resur Resurgum, XYZ. Um, Time Thief card, Double Edged Sword, Megalith, Arda Trun. Uh, I didn't do a pack trick, trick on this one. Um, Cross Sheep. I've seen people use that before. But this is a cool looking card. Um, yeah, and then some other commons. But, move those over. Megalith, Arda Tron. So foil to that. Link monster. Oh no, is a ritual monster? Yeah, ritual monster. Cool card. Pack five. Let's just look at that pack art for a second. I think it's pretty cool. Mission assault. Pack five. I never know exactly at what speed to be opening these packs, but four. If you guys ever feel the need, just throw a comment up there. Kind of give me some advice or just like preferences. Be super helpful. At Mr. Card. Oh, looking cicada looking thing. Trans cicada. AI shadow. Time thief. Guard Ghost, Megalith Emergence, Megalith Higgeth, and something wrong, but yeah, here's an Ultra. It's a pretty cool looking card. Ancient Warrior card. I like that a lot. I'm guessing two to three Ultras is, is what it is, and a Secret Rare. I don't know if that takes a spot of the an Ultra, but um, that's my guess for this, this set. Nice ultra. This pack. What is this? Pack six. Three and four to the front. Puppet, Ghost Trick Fair, Fairy, Ghost Trick Fairy, Time Thief, Time Thief Startup, Shiny Black Sea, Add Ignister, Nine Lives Cat, hey, Plunder Patrol card, another Ultra, there we go, that's what I was looking for, I don't know if this card's used in Plunder Patrol, but I like the, I like the artwork a lot. I'm happy we got a Plunder Patrol card. Hopefully, we get some cool 
One Piece cards from the, the other half of this opening. The other half of this pack battle. Okay. Um, execution of the contract. Water Leviathan at Ignister. Bellcat Fighter. Um, a... What is that? Link Party. Gamma Oil. Change Up. And another Super. That Ignister card. I wonder how the At Ignister decks are. Pretty nice foiling. I like the green in this. It's cool. Nice. Next pack. I guess the only thing for these sets that I'm not exactly sure about, I want to be more hype for the stuff that is hype worthy. I'm not exactly sure. So, next time I get a, an ultra or something like that, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna act type, no matter what card it is. AI Shadow, Time Thief, Megalith, Dropper, Shiny Black, Guard, Ghost, AI Ritual. Hey, it's the cover card. Nice. Light Dragon at Ignister. Look at that. They didn't even make an ultra. I guess it probably has like a maybe a secret rare. That's that's it. Nice, nice pull. We did it. Truthfully, I'm pretty happy with that. Got the cover card and a plunder patrol card. Now just a secret rare and round out this whole whole set. Four. AI. Um, matching outfits with more, um, like, I don't know what card that is, but it's definitely some other kind of, um, Yu-Gi-Oh artwork on their t-shirts. It's pretty cool. Another little goblin t-shirts. Um, Winds of Mischief, Trans Cicada, Addict Mister, Megalith, Dropper, Guard Ghost, and Megalith Guard. Cool. Plenty of packs left. Probably a little bit further than halfway, I'd say. Get the open packs and make videos, so this is a win-win for me. Excuse me. Fiendish. What is that? Portrait? I can't I can't even see what that is. Oh, portrait. I could not see those letters. Fiendish portrait. Cupid serve. Um, contract. Cash in. Megalith. Uh, gravity controller. Um, Crusted, Armory Call, hey, our secret rare, Sales Pitch, I don't think that's a good one, but we'll give it a, a nice, uh, oh, oh my goodness, Sales Pitch, nice, I just like the uh, Pot of Greed, that's, that's nice artwork, oh wait, no, that's Pot of Duality, I'm not sure. The one with two faces, right? Not sure about that, but that's nice. I'll put that right there. Uh -huh. Anything else crazy in here? Ooh. 
One, two, three, four. Megalith. Puppet. Megalith. Time Thief. Ghost Meat Girl. Um, learner Device. Charged Up. Uh, yeah. Kuji Kitty. Kuji Kitty. Oh, just flopping all over here. That's better. Another pack. One, two, three, four. Let's go Starlight. Come on. This pack. We're gonna Starlight. Mischief. Cupid. Okay. Things are getting tight. Cupid. Let's move that down. Oh, contract. Cash in. XYZ. Megalith. Gravity. That's better. Gravity controller. And. Unchained Soul. These are crazy. These are crazy good looking cards. I really like these. Pack. This one has the starlight in it for sure. No doubt in my mind. One, two, three, four. Or another ultra, that'd be great. Um Trans Cicada. Megalith. Cash in. Strike. Emergence. Dropper. Guard Ghost. Another Ultra, nice. Right? Yeah. Dark Templar at Ignister. Getting a lot of good at Ignister cards. I've never seen somebody use that kind of deck though, so I'm guessing it's probably hot garbage. What is that? Is that our third ultra, I think? Third ultra, one secret. Let's get an error box. More secrets. One, two, three, four. Tell us all your secrets. Um, it's an Archbeam card. First time I've seen that one. Um, some kind of crazy looking camel. Uvu a loop. Fairy. Destruction. Dropper. Guard Ghost, Emergence, Megalith, Megalith, oh, what? Hmm. Oh, it's just, yeah, I see. Super, super duper. Next, pack. One, two, three, four. Crazy Camel. Fairy, Destruction card, Mischief, Crusted, Armed Call, Dropper, and um, Generator Boss of Delusion. It's just a castle. Is there something on top of the castle? No, I can't tell. Can you guys see? Nice looking card though. Nice, nice. Very nice. Next pack. Starlight. Here we come. One, two, three, flat fighter. Matching outfits. Rocket. Nine, seven. 9,763. Battle Survivor. Ooh, I like that. Squeak and Knight. Squeak Knight? Squeak Knight. Excuse me. 
learn learner device Jacko Bolin and a Fire Phoenix at Ignister. Hmm. Nice looking Halloween type card. Cool. Good super. I could get <laughs> getting these rarities completely wrong. So uh, yeah. Front of me. Four, one, two, three, and four. Flippy. Water. Added Mr. Card. Um, I don't even. How do you say his last, that last name? Kun Nam Zan. Strike. Bell Cat Fighter. Gamma Oil. Dropper, shiny black sea, and the same one. Well, not same as last one, but we already have that one. That one was kind of hard to open. It's the hardest pack I've had it to open. So. Um, Ancient Warrior, Uvu Alu, um, Megalith. Rocket, Squeak Knight, Ritual, Charged Up, Gravity Controller, Ancient Knight. Come on, there's got to be another sick card in there. Something, something to really get a hype. All these have these print lines. I don't know if you guys can tell. A lot of these first ones have these print lines. It's kind of annoying. One, two, three, four. Another new card. I haven't seen this one. Earth something. Earth Golem. Agnister. Send off. Head judging. Gamma oil. Charged up. Shiny Black Sea. Ad Agnister. Code Talker. Did it. Code Talkers seem like they'd be a fun deck. That'd be a pretty chill deck to do. Build. One, two, three, and four. Ancient Warrior. Bell Cat Fighter. Send Off. AI Shadow. Megalith. Nine Lives Cat. Attic Mister. Gamma M MBL. Hey, a second secret rare. That's nice. Ignister AI Land. I know this one's bad. I remember seeing this one. Um, but that's pretty dope. Two secret rares. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Bunch of Dudes Pack Battle. I'm sure Reed has already said that, but I'm Schaefer. I've finally been invited to do a pack battle against Reed. So, um, I'm sure Reed's already showed, but he's doing, uh, we're doing One Piece cards, apparently, which I've never even seen. No, I guess I've seen them, but I've never, I didn't know, I've never opened them. I've never even held one in my hand. But today, Reed has sponsored uh, the pack battle, giving me some One Piece cards, and I'm gonna open them and see if I get anything good. I'm sure he's explained the rules. He's gonna have to give away some cards if I open anything better than him. So, unless he did it the other way, which he might have, I don't know. Anyway, so, let's get right into it. I'm gonna start with this one. I think there's six things total here. One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh mat today. Old timey, but good. And I'm gonna figure out how to get into these. I remember Reed saying these, these packs were just awful to get into. So I'm just gonna tear open that. I don't know the best way to do this. Just gonna tear into it. Let's see what we got. I don't know also if there's any trick to this. It might not be. Oh my gracious. How are you doing? Open this. Nice, okay. 
There might not be any tricks to One Piece cards, I don't know. They might put the, the most valuable one in the back like any sane person would do. Okay, I assume that's some kind of action card. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go through it this way. Krieg, okay, haven't gotten that far. Kuruzumi Hiragushi, Hira, Hir, Higurashi, haven't gotten that far either. Kawamatsu, this better not be all stuff that I haven't seen yet. I've watched like 500 episodes of One Piece approximately. So, Speed, Cow Lady, that's pretty sick. Elephant Guy, Elephant Marchu. Bartolomeo, I've heard of him, but I haven't seen him. Wire, Gordon, Komurasaki, cool. Hitaro, Hi, Hitokiri, Kamazo, pretty sick. Page one. Oh, Rowan the Azoro, let's go, somebody I actually know. That looks pretty sick, the photo is pretty cool on that. Pretty, pretty sweet Rowan Noah card. I just realized I may have been holding these out slightly out of the frame. Anyways, here's the one that matters. Rowan Noah Zoro. Pretty cool. Let's see the next one. See, the thing about this is I, I know vaguely what Yu-Gi-Oh cards are valuable. I have no idea for One Piece, so. I guess we'll see. Rowan Noah Zoro, that's a cool card anyways. Probably not the coolest One Piece character. I mean, obviously Usopp is the best character in One Piece. But Zoro, he's all right. He's better, he's better than Sanji, let's be real. Okay, so this isn't always an action card. I don't know why I keep starting this upside down. I'm gonna slide this over here. Look how orderly my setup is, it's amazing. Komachio, don't know him. Pacifista, oh, I do know what that is. I love me some Kuma, he's pretty sick. Cavendish, don't know him. Inarashi, don't know him. These are all commons, right? Surely they're all commons. I mean, they have to be. Hydro, Elephant Marcho, Mosha, Desert Spada, Kiyoshiro, Kozuki Odin. Oh my gosh, who's up? God, who's up? The best character in the whole show. And Jinbei. Hmm. I don't know if either of those are going to be worth anything, even though this card should really be worth quite a bit. Because um, it's pretty sick. I mean, it's Usopp, so. <clears throat> Alright, so sorry. My camera died. But, as I was saying, Usopp. Best character. Good card. Alright. Next box. Let's bust it open. Basically, I guess I'm just going to end up talking about One Piece while I, while I do this. So, overall, good show. Really good. Um, Probably like a eight or nine out of 10, if I was ranking them. Throw my trash off my desk here. Probably an eight or nine out of 10, if I had to rank it. Um, uh, pretty much that ranking, I think, comes from the characters because the characters are phenomenal and the world building, really good. <clears throat> Character interactions are really great, actually, is, is a big part of it. All right, these things. I don't, I, is this even an action card? I don't actually know what that is. I don't know why I keep pulling that out first, also. Carrot, have seen her. I haven't gotten to that part in the show yet. Virgo, Bao Huang, Jean Bart, Holden, Green Star, Raffle Sia, Mocha, Kuru, Kur, Kuruzumi Orochi, Desert Spada, Kaido, I know him, I've heard of him. Oh, Gecko Moria, okay, definitely know him. Uta, she kind of looks like Pepsi Chan. Oh wait, this is the shine, this is the foil card, my bad. <laughs> she kind of looked like Pepsi Chan from uh, Fire Emblem Fates. All right, Fire Emblem Fates, I think that's what it's called. Anywho, don't think that one looks valuable. The Zoro looks valuable, this one does not look valuable. Next pack. All right. I, th these are made so weird. There's like no clear way of how to get into this. You just gotta tear into it like a caveman. Yeah. All right. Tear the side off. Okay. Sai. Alvita. I definitely know her. <coughs> Bao Huang. Sachi. Hold him. I'm gonna be pronouncing some of these wrong and people are gonna make fun of me, but freak you guys. Jinbei. Ashra Doji. 
Trafalgar Law. I definitely know him. He's very cool. Oh, Nico Robin. That one's kind of foily. That one looks a little, a little fancy. Nice. Okay. Nico Robin. And Overheat. What is that? An event? Interesting. Okay, I could put this one on top, because this one is a little fancier than Robin, but I'm putting Robin on top, because I, I, I know Robin. Yeah, right now, where I'm at, Boa Hancock has just been introduced. Well, I say just been. It's been like, I feel like 30 episodes since she's been introduced, but it feels like she just got introduced compared to, to the rest of it. Oh, I hope I'm not tearing up those cards when I rip open the side like this. And Boa Hancock, she looks down on people so hard that she looks up. Let's just say that. Okay, Alvita. Speed. Carrot. Smiley. Jane Bart. A lot of rep uh, repeats here. Baba Nuki. Round table. In two years, Sabayodi Archipelago. That's where I'm at, kind of. Who's who? Mr. Three Gallon. Caesar Clown. That's kind of oily. And Oikiku. All right, these are looking pretty bad so far, except for that Roanoa, of course. All right, am I my last one? All right, last one here of the One Piece packs, at least. I do have a phase two of pack opening coming after this part, because Reed really loaded us up on the cards this week. How's that man having so much money? It's crazy. Ugh. Okay, Scratch Man Apu. Oh yeah, he's pretty sick. I love when he plays his fleshy arm <laughs> as a trumpet. Cavendish, Kree, Kanjiro, Officer Agents. Oh, Miss Double Finger. Oh my goodness. Spiky Lady. <laughs> Sheep's Horn, Mr. One. He's cool. He's also kind of spiky in a way. Um, Ulti Mortar, Rizo, Uta, <gasps> Ken Iman. Ken, Ken, Ken Iman. I don't know him, but his car looks cool. He's got the same foil as Rowan No Row. So that's pretty sick. I don't know what the haul is here. This one definitely looks like it would be the most valuable though. That's pretty sick. Anywho. So there's the one piece card. I'm gonna stack all of these and I'm gonna put Rowan Noah on top. That's a free ton of cards. Look how many cards that is. What are we even gonna do with those now? Who knows? Alright. Second thing that Reed got is this booster uh, for Lord of the Rings. Bro's been watching Post Malone get that one ring. Anywho, so I've never even seen these. Oh no, wait, this is Magic, I'm stupid. <laughs> this is Magic the Gathering. I didn't know Magic was affiliated with Lord of the Rings. That's cool. Anyways, let's bust it open in there. One pack. Ooh, and these squishy things, these are my favorite. <laughs> I used to like these when I was a kid. I don't know why, okay, sorry. Lord of the Rings, Magic the Gathering. I've never played Magic before. Does that make me a loser or more of a loser or less of a loser? Who knows? Please don't get mad at me for saying that. It was just a joke. I play Yu-Gi-Oh. That's probably, that's much worse actually, definitely. Okay, now how do I get into this is the question. Okay, okay. Teeth technique. There we go. That was a ticket. Not a huge Lord of the Rings fan right here. I'm, uh, I think they're I. Right. Am I just saying tons of controversial opinions today? I don't know. Token creature, tentacle. Oh, tricked me. Generous Ent. Fog on the Barrow Downs. Are these all foil? I mean, that's a, that counts as foil, right? Surely it does. Smite the Deathless. Stew the Conies. Barrow Blade. Plains. Lost Isle Calling. The ring goes south. Champions of Minas Tirith. Faramir, Field Commander. I can pronounce these a lot better. The end of the Prancing Pony. Knights of Dol Amroth. Nazgul. Oh, and Balrog, the Durin's Bane. These two look the most valuable. Hard to say for sure, but they look the most valuable. Okay. Now, what else do we have here? Looks like he's got... Just a few Yu-Gi-Oh packs too, just for fun these it would seem. We got Legendary Duelists. Oh, I dropped these, I'm gonna have to reach and grab them. Uh -uh. 
what well, Una Momento. Edit this out, read. He probably won't. He probably won't even watch it to that part. <laughs> okay. Anyways, to finish it off, Legendary Duelist, Synchro Storm, Magical Hero, and Cyberstorm Access. I'm gonna start with this one. Actually, I'm gonna start with this one. Actually, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna start with this one. Yu Gi Oh! packaging is, is the best packaging, I, I think. Except for those new boxes, those look miserable. High Speed Roid, Chanbara, Speed Roid, Red Eyed Dice, Synchron Explorer, Lyra Lusk, Cobalt Sparrow, and High Speed Roid, Kite Drake. I don't think any of those are worth anything, from what I know of, at least. Which is not a lot. I mean, I played like Blue Eyes, and that's why I'm, I'm not. I'm not very caught up on Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay. Magician's Rod. Oh, let's go. I know that card. That's for Dark Magician. <laughs> Utopic Future and Automata Pickup. None of those are good. Actually, Magician's Rod, I don't know if... Th that's definitely... That's probably not worth anything. Probably not. I mean, it's got to be a pretty common card, right? Bust into this bad boy. I, I feel like I'm going to damage these cards the way I tear into them. I mean... I just go for it, you know? <laughs> please, please open for me. Also, sorry if this seems like an unprofessional card opening. Like I said, this is my first time I've done this on the camera. Most of the time I'm running the Minecraft videos on this channel. Yeah. Whoop. Scoop. <laughs> I'm just pushing off the side. Wait, I would love it if I pulled something just crazy out of one of these boxes because that would just be hype. I mean, I might have already ready. This might be worth something. Who knows? For these ones, I have at least a little bit of an idea. Solfachord, Solfachord, Symphony. Kitsune Kitsubi, Money Ear Enthusiast. I'm like revealing what's coming up next. I'm see, I'm I'm a new bit this Pendulum Pendant. Time, Tyranny, Morgan Morganite, Dynamorphia Intact, Nemluria, Dream Defender, Dual Avatar, Manifested Aun, and New Frontier. Alright, none of those look very promising, I'm not gonna lie, but that's okay. Time, Tyranny, Morganite, the only foil, so, there you go, there you have it. Looks like this Rono Azora was probably the most valuable. I'll have to check on that after after I, if I wrap up here. But so, anyways, pretty sick overall. I mean, I would sit this on my desk. It looks pretty cool. I actually would sit the Usopp. Where is that? I'll go back and get that one later. That was the coolest card. Not gonna lie. And uh, yeah, so I guess that's pretty much it. Do I have to do anything else for you? He would let me know if he was here. Okay, well, that's all. Hey guys, if you guys enjoyed the video today, it'd be awesome if you could leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. It'd help out a lot. Thanks.